Hey everyone, what's going on? Welcome to a uh, little and a SS crew plays uh, Dead by Daylight. It's myself, Mathis, Ryan, aka Northern Lions, Invicta, and Last Grey Wolf, who is alive after a 24-hour stream. What's going on, guys? Uh, it's, excuse me, it's the Tournament of Shame crew presents. Uh, yeah. Come on. Tournament of Shame crew X and LSS 2.0 colon the rehab. Final HD remix. Yeah, 2.8. <laughs> Reloaded and resurrected. Cut. <laughs> the integrity. <laughs> What's going on, guys? Nothing. About to have the three easiest games of my life. Oh, oh my god. Oh, Here we go. Right Man, off the you've been playing Evolve. You should know that the survivors don't have guns in this game. <laughs> I know. But yeah, Dan is the killer is like playing against my oh, two-year-old niece. So. Jesus Christ. Oh. Why hey. would your two-year-old niece be trying to kill you? That's a good question. Why would Dan be trying to kill me? Bring back the Minecraft series. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I still get messages like that. Where's Tekkit? You can't complain about any hate that you bring upon yourself anymore. Oh, no. I don't give just, a shit. No, the hate's going to come. The hate's going to come when I get to be the killer and I wipe you guys out in 20 minutes. All right. So I'm, I'm, I'm oh throwing gosh. a deal out there. If anyone sells out Mathis, I'll trade oh, it for no. your, your being able to run out untouched. <laughs> Sorry. Is that off? That offer's on the table for this entire match. Just, <laughs> you, can, you can claim it at any time you want. Just I had to perform emergency surgery on my computer by getting rid of the controller that was oh, in. Yeah, I did exactly the same thing. So I just like banged my hand, pulling the controller out really quick. That's why I failed that generator four times. Oh, crap. Now, I didn't get to be a killer last time we played, and a lot of people were upset about that. So I think I might be able to do a killer this time around. Yeah, please do. I ain't a killer, but don't push me. Okay, that is that the same guy who sings, I got a killer inside of me. Can't talk to my mother, so I talk to my diary. No, I actually, I quoted Tupac, but I was actually, internally, I was looking for the guy from Office Space. Yeah, you know, okay, because yeah, yeah. that is actually... Michael um, Bolton? Michael Bolton <laughs> singing that uh, talk to my mother, so I talk to my diary song. Yeah. yeah. That was a I great got a killer reference. inside of me. I don't, I don't know how the rest of it goes, though. He doesn't yeah, talk to his mother, so he talks to his diary. Yeah, there you go. Is that because how it he goes? turns down the music afterwards. <laughs> Why does he do that, Tim Victor? Uh, because everyone's always afraid of uh, blaring rap music too loud because it might oh. disturb the peace. Okay, I got you, I got you. Why else would he do that? <laughs> I don't yeah. know. I, I forgot that part of the movie. <laughs> oh, no. Austin, how you feeling, man? I'm feeling good. I'm feeling bad because I can't. I can't relate to movies ever. <laughs> I don't watch movies. Who hasn't seen movies? Office Space? I haven't seen. I have not even. I have not seen Office Space oh either. So God. don't worry. This guy had to cancel some videos to see the 2 p.m. matinee of Deadpool <laughs> on launch day. Deadpool is the comedy <laughs> of our generation. All right, Dan. He's, he's clearly been practicing his supervisory skills. <laughs> I'm well, not part say about that. Uh, excuse generation. me, streamer. Camping is not fun to watch. Could you please step away? <laughs> I'm trying to distract him by totally, indefinitely, intentionally failing this generator over and over. I, I'm, I'm meaning to do this for sure. <laughs> Get out of your dance. <laughs> oh, he I got. Guess. Oh, I thought you got Austin. I didn't know you got Ryan. Yeah, he's I'm, never gonna leave that spot. I have a scent of an egg. <laughs> you're gonna you're gonna have two eggs here soon. I got, I got in, a, in a couple of weeks. Of is it sulfurous out there or something? Sulfur? So oh, right. this, is a, this is a sensitive story, but save Ryan, you know, save Ryan, save Ryan, save him now, save him now. The other day, you know, I was a little Whoa, flatulent. I you know, I, I was farting a little bit. What? Sounds and like my then, every day. Yeah, but then Kate, you know, she's my wife. She knows what they smell like. She came out into the kitchen and like 20 minutes later, she was like, did you just cook an egg? <laughs> I was like, no, that's that leftover. My butt. Can, uh... can I just address what just happened there? I was I was busily working on a generator. I stepped back to because Dan was like coming into the general vicinity and then I teleported to a random spot on the map. Yep. No, I got DC'd as well. So like, then Dan got good. Something crazy happened there. Hey, um, Ryan, what did you eat for that meal prior to? Honestly, I can't remember. Or was it a combination of you off biking 15 miles with a chromium helmet? I don't think that that... <laughs> I don't think my helmet's made out of chromium. Chromium? I thought you have a chromium helmet. 
Why would I have a chromium Chrom helmet? You think I'm <laughs> fucking Magneto? Oh, because it's a chrome dome. <laughs> no, I thought is you that, said is that the shiny joke? shiny silver helmet. It's not shiny or silver. Well, actually, you know what? It is shiny and silver. See, that's what we've already discussed this. It looks like Dennis Hopper's head when he plays Bowser in the Mario Brothers movie. I knew you were gonna say that. <laughs> Is it bad that I've like... seen that movie? What? Wow, <laughs> awesome! Awful. You you just can't talk about movies ever again. I can, man. I can. It's just the worst topic for me. I gotta get it up inside of me. <laughs> How's a uh, generator looking for uh, for you, Ryan? Seventy percent. I've seen the Mario Brothers movie, but I haven't seen Shawshank Redemption. Uh, really. Mario I Brothers. also have not seen the Shawshank Redemption. Okay, Dan no. is Dan is uh, relatively close. He's going around the big tractor. He just bing bonged. John Leguizamo. Talk about falling from oh. grace, man. That guy's career has been the equivalent of a yo-yo. <laughs> no, that because he gets risen from grace as well. He's beer, he's, he's... bing bonging. He's <laughs> out, out. Yum. Oh, it's at 99%! Just touch it! Yum? <laughs> Yum! Man, this scene right here is like a picture of what your life's gonna be like with Desmond in like two years. What? <laughs> you're just gonna have this like wriggling human body over your shoulder trying to escape and you're like, No, you gotta go to bed, it's 6.30. <laughs> no, that's gonna be you at PAX West when I capture you in four What? You're gonna kill me at PAX You're gonna West. kill Ryan at PAX? That's, that could be confirmed. <laughs> and this is a, this is premeditated. You can use this as evidence. Oh my god! I was talking about known, in, 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 in Magic the Gathering and Magic. Oh yeah. Uh... I just wanted to be known. I don't consent to this murder. So if I wind up dead in September, you better <laughs> seek this guy out. If you consent to a murder, is it a crime? Uh, there's been like cases about it. Like that dude in Germany who was like, "I want someone to kill me and then eat my body." What? Then they were like, <laughs> they were like, "Do we prosecute the murderer?" Because it was kind of like he, they asked for it, and the answer was yes, they probably yeah. Because you can't do you can't do assisted suicide in a lot of countries. That's basically the same thing, isn't it? I mean, it, yeah, I would say it's basically the same thing, and then you eat them after. All right, <laughs> well, RIP at comments. least Math has got away unscathed, unharmed, and the only one alive. What I tell you, Math, this, this was is, a man of his word. My this game's was a nice poor game. game. <laughs> so what do we do? Just go return to lobby, or how do we re up here? Yeah, just return to lobby, and then Austin can join yeah, us again. Join, yeah. That that's so, weird. My game didn't even crash. It just said, "No, you won. Congrats." You're, you're so what now. happened? Did that guy turn into like hamburger or something? <laughs> right. Uh, what are you talking about? The oh, the Germany. Okay. Uh, let me let me look it up while Austin's. Oh, that that's not return to lobby, Dan. Germany. I click, re I click return Dan's. to lobby. German man wants to be eaten. <laughs> that's that's a lot of different Google things. search you want in your history I, right there. I can't believe you guys haven't heard of it. He's got his own Wikipedia article. Oh, man. He's a German man who achieved international notoriety for killing and eating a voluntary victim who he found via the internet, of course. <laughs> after this. After his name and the victim jointly attempted to eat the victim's severed penis, he killed the victim and proceeded to eat a large amount of his flesh. Oh, you know what? Maybe it was a miscommunication. He was like, I want somebody to cut off my penis and eat it with me. But he <laughs> didn't say, kill me afterwards. <laughs> I feel like if that if that situation you're going into, you want to make sure you have all the specifics <laughs> down. There's just way too much confusion for so much, you know, dense stuff there imagine he felt very embarrassed as he was getting killed he's like oh i can see how you got that impression but i just wanted to share the consumption of my severed penis with you do you think it tastes like fish fillet <laughs> maybe yours God. does i don't know what do you think i mean it can't taste that much different than real meat one way i imagine know why you went to fish out of all these cases, <laughs> that's the meat why fish dan I don't know. Maybe because cod is only a few letters away from. <laughs> <laughs> from. <laughs> yeah, from. <laughs> All right. If, like I said, the offer's still on the table. If you see Mathis, just tell me where he is. <laughs> I'll let you go free. If I get Mathis. Gotta get him. Gotta get him. Live or die. I just want to complete this game. Live or yeah, die, that man. Would be a good start. Live or die. People oh, really like the last Dead by Daylight episode. Yeah. What happened in it? Uh, well, we did one game, what? and then we couldn't get in a lobby because it patched, <laughs> so we all downloaded the patch. We played one more game, and then I had a crash. No, you've got uh... one of your cat. Oh, right, my cat. 
uh, took a poop on Kate's floor, so I cleaned it up halfway through the video. It's a great video. I'm already caught, classic. by the way. How'd that happen? Uh, Dan literally came straight for me, and then I threw the pallet down, and I ended up right next to him. Yo, he you left, wiggle you wiggled. You just got Mr. Wigglesworth, though. Good for you. Mr. Wiggles. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Jonathan Wigglesworth. Kelly's Wigglesworth. Does anyone know who that is? No. I have no, no idea. idea. I thought is. Ryan might. Who's Kelly Wigglesworth? Uh, she's the uh, second place finisher in the original Survivor. Oh, <laughs> yeah. She <laughs> lost to Richard Hatch. Yeah? Yeah. The... You guys so, ever uh... <laughs> this guy. <laughs> this guy got jokes. <laughs> Speaking of jokes. Invicta, can you uh, tell everyone the, the glory that you brought to my world yesterday? The, oh uh, God, the here we go. It's so good. The it's going to be the next week of your life. It's so good. <laughs> Austin, did you see this? I didn't see this. What happened? Oh, it's so good. Mathis, you can't say that with the <laughs> I'm going to Klingon beefs. Hey, listen. That even made it into one of my, my videos. Hello? Hello, hi. Oh, okay. Sorry, we had some... What's going on, man? We had some wild shit. What? <laughs> what are you it's hunting? Morels in your house or something? What's, what's well, I'm hunting mushrooms? <laughs> what's some wild-ish going on? <laughs> oh, no. Sinvicta DC. Oh, that's why it sounded like Sinvicta cut out halfway oh. through this conversation. Ooh. Oh, no. Well, this is a great uh, episode <laughs> so far as well. <laughs> you can't wake up. <laughs> are you holding something, uh, Dan? Are you holding a body? I no. He started running for the. He was like running directly into a brick wall. So I tried to scoop him up, but it kind of worked out uh, not in my favor. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, like, Sin Victor showed us this video. We're late to the party. It has like five million views or something. Is that but... the first time you've seen it? Yesterday? Yeah, it, okay. it actually was the first time I'd seen it. This kid, he's probably like I don't know, fifteen, fourteen. He <laughs> takes a glow stick and microwaves it so it starts to glow like a fucking <laughs> nuclear fuel rod and then he takes it out of the microwave and shakes it and it just oh. explodes in his face i've <laughs> seen this actually yeah i saw this a but, couple years ago but that's yeah, only the half of it that's the first half and you go oh what an idiot right <laughs> and then the next is like the the next four minutes is his dad just like passive aggressively trying to help him but also being really disappointed <laughs> What does he say? He has like the best quote ever. Like, you're always doing this. Yeah, he's like, you could always be sorry after it happens. <laughs> what do you do? You will go wear a beautiful shirt like that. <laughs> I'm going blind, Dad. <laughs> I'm going blind. Yeah, he's like, what if I go fucking blind? <laughs> I don't know, Jack. Okay. That's the thing, though. He's like so on the shirt. He's like, it's a beautiful yeah. shirt. <laughs> What's the like got it all over your awesome shirt? <laughs> and then the, the kid is like. I'm sure it'll come out. And he's like, yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> he also is like the first time in my entire life I have ever heard an adult call a child a dingling in a situation that serious. <laughs> oh the kid God. is like, dad, help me. And then the dad's like, I got to see how to help you, you dingling. <laughs> he's like got he's toxic, to read a... <laughs> toxic waste all over his face. He's trying to read a half shredded wrapper on the <laughs> <laughs> on the glow stick. It's probably like 99 cents with no instructions on it. <laughs> oh, dude. And DC kid... again. <laughs> I was opening the door, too. The kid's cornea is burning out of his eyes. <laughs> Alright, so just math this, huh? Ooh. Yeah. This is impossible to play. Not to disappoint you, Dan, but it's done. Admit this. I was going to escape. I was opening the fucking door and the game's like, oh, you escaped. Congrats. <laughs> Zero points. Well, well, <laughs> the score is 11,000, 4,000, 0, 0, 8,000. That's a good start. Let's, let's all tab and see what's gone in here. My so do I go? just completely died. What happened? Oh, it's internet? Mine. Because, oh, this is, this is too good. I, I exited, I exited the party and my game crashed. Good lord, this goddamn game. <laughs> well, to be fair, Sinvicta's internet dying is not the game's fault, probably. No. No, but kicking Austin two games in two a row. Two games and then crashing. And then <laughs> crashing is the game's can, fault. Can you launch with 
two survive three survivors and one killer. Yeah. All two right. Two survivors well, and a killer you can. Well, let's wait for Austin. I'm just saying to come back. Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm I'm booting up here. We need him to fix some generators before he inevitably gets disconnected. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this is like uh, a test build, right? This is pre pre Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, yeah it's, uh, uh, it's, it'll be it'll be fixed. <laughs> I gotta kill up inside of me. Uh, I'm stuck at the uh, the jail calendar. Is that a bug? Oh, yeah. Sorry, you, what? You probably need to start a new lobby then. Oh, God. <laughs> How many things? <laughs> I'm just gonna leave the lobby. Yeah, that's a good idea. Dan, what's your favorite rap or and or hip hop song of all time? Hold on, ask me that again, because I paused the recording. <laughs> <laughs> what's your favorite rap and or hip hop song of all time? I think you know. Really, like, uh, when I was in college and... Oh, God. Mathis. <laughs> I didn't even say anything. <laughs> Mathis. I don't, know. <laughs> I don't even... Just continue. Well, why did you say, oh, God? <laughs> uh, just hearing about you in high school and college just gave me in hilarious thoughts of Dan, what he would be like in high school and college. And what would I be like in high school and college? <laughs> Popped Mathis. collar, frosted tips, gold Get chain. Get out of here! <laughs> <laughs> That's what you think I was? <laughs> but that's how you are now. <laughs> that's besides the point. <laughs> Matt, did you really think I was like that? I don't know how you were. Dan, be. how were you? I was wait, wait, just... wait, wait, wait. Dan, are you making a game? Yes, I am. Okay. Continue then. I, I just mean, joined on him. I was just like, uh, just like I am now, kind of. Kind of. Pop collar, <laughs> golden chain, kinda? frosted I don't wear tips. Pop collar. <laughs> pop collar. Is that the kind of? All colors are just waiting to be popped. Ever since I can remember. We're going to roll with this crew, right? I guess so, yes. Invicta right. said he's talking to his Comcast technician. <laughs> Way to sell out Comcast, Ryan. Jeez. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> There's only like two providers in the continental United States. <laughs> Who's the for other 50 one? 50% of your opportunity. Cox Communications. Support. What about Xfinity? Warner Brothers? X the Xfinity is Comcast. It's a shoot off of uh, Comcast. <laughs> what about Net, Net Zero? <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> oh, God. Earthlink. Who loves Earthling? What was your guys' first internet service provider? Netscape. I actually had a um, a local one before they all got bought out by like huge national corporations. We had one that was just local to our city. Can you tell me what that is, or does it violate your two-factor fa authentication? <laughs> what? <laughs> it was. Um, I think they might still be around. Actually, it was KOS Kingston Online Services, located in LaSalle Muse, downtown Kingston, Ontario, baby. <laughs> Go front to next. I'm trying to think of the sports team that represents them. What was your high school mascot? Okay, now we're getting a little. <laughs> Come on, what was your mother's maiden name? <laughs> oh, shit. What was the name of the first car you ever owned? <laughs> Wait, but Dan, what's your favorite hip hop song of all time? Um, I'm gonna have to say Through the Wire. Really? Okay, yeah. I like it. It's early Kanye, tells a story, triumph over adversity. Yeah, and at the time, see, because you were just like probably three years old when that came out, but at the time, <laughs> it was just really, really different than anything was out. Yeah, it's orchestral. Time. Yeah, and he used a little uh, sampling. Yeah. But uh, what about you? Uh, I was thinking like Through the Wire, like it came out during a formative time in my life when I was three years old and uh, <laughs> really introduced me to the hip hop genre. <laughs> this guy, no, for real. Dan, leave me alone. <laughs> That was the longest chase game I've ever been a part of, I think, in this game. Uh, excuse me, Strimmer. I'm still yeah. chasing you. Ryan, you? What, what's your favorite hip-hop song? It might be Luchini, honestly, man. Every, every time it comes on, it just gives me a little bit of a, like an endorphin rush, even though I've heard it 2,000 times. I still don't know what the fuck Sonny Chiba says in the whole song. <laughs> so that's how I knew you were going to be all right. You know, so long story <laughs> short, so long story <laughs> short, Mathis, I met Mathis at PAX. East 2013? Uh, East, yeah. Or 2014? 2013. 13, I think. And uh, anyway, you guys know the story about the ruse he set up. And then, so when we. Ruse he set up. <laughs> what do we Lord. go? PAX East the following year or was it PAX West? Yeah, that was PAX East 2014. Or sorry, PAX, PAX West 2014. So I ended up staying with Mathis, Kate, and Ryan. And I didn't, I mean, I knew Mathis. I didn't really know Kate and Ryan. And we stayed in that little Airbnb, which was really sweet. But, anyways, it was like after the first night and. Kate's on her computer. We're just kind of hanging out. And then Ryan just randomly starts playing this obscure 90s hip hop song called Lucini. I'm like, this guy's going to be all right. You know, because at that time, <laughs> the jury was kind of out on you. <laughs> That's when you knew. 
That's when you do. That's, that's really good. I mean, it's a great song. It is, it's not, I don't know if I'd say it's obscure, but it is lesser known for sure. It's really obscure. I mean, they used to play that on like, like number 30 back when it came out. <laughs> yeah, there's like three rap of radio stations growing up as a kid, and they played it at like 2 a.m. on the third, the third worst <laughs> rap station in Detroit. So that's how I knew of it. Yeah, but it's like sushi in Japan, right? Like the third worst rap station in Detroit is still probably like on par with the best rap station in Canada. <laughs> well, it depends if you're talking about Kingston or not. <laughs> I thought you grew up in Barry. Barry? No, it's Barry. <laughs> Barry. It probably doesn't sound as silly to you guys, but having lived semi close to Barry my whole life. It's like you just called it like Toronto or something. <laughs> Um, Mathis and Austin, do you guys have a favorite rap song? I do not know any rap songs at all. What about the Fresh Prince of Bel Air? I mean, I know that one. <laughs> That's, I don't really Ooh. listen to it. Little Arms this year. Ooh! Ooh, you got me! <laughs> nice one. Ugh. I'm a, I'm a dad rock kind of guy. You can ask Ryan. Austin is 100% on the dad rock train. What's your favorite dad rock song, Austin? <laughs> now that's tough. Uh, four play slash long time. Oh, that's a good one. How does that go? That's more than a feeling. How do the hey, lyrics go for that song? Door. Oh shit! Never mind. You got a door. How do you guys already have a door open? I'm finishing the generator anyway. I want the points. Maximize. More than a Steven. <laughs> Wait, than what? Steven. How does your song God go? God damn it! I I I DC'd. <laughs> oh my God! It's the door, man. <laughs> it's the fucking door. <sighs> Mathis, what's your favorite song of all time? I can't pick one. The entire masterpiece of Smash Mouth is Astro Lounge. Is uh. Smash mouth is. Smash your mouth! And then I'm, I'm, mouth I'm just gonna get this door. I'll let you go back and get Mathis. Go ahead, Ryan, get out. <laughs> I got the door. Works for me. I actually did not mean to leave. I meant to hide behind that pillar and then save you, but instead. <laughs> it's fine. The video makes you look like a, a dang asshole. I would have left you. I Matt, know. this is the kind of guy that in third grade you beat him in Pokemon, and right when you're about to drop the last kill on him, he's like, ah, let you win anyways. <laughs> <laughs> just joking, Matt. So oh, this is a stellar episode, Dead by Daylight. <laughs> I get to play about 30% of each game. Yep, that's more than Zuvicta did. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, uh, check out the other per person's perspective in the description below. And uh, we'll probably try and record another one that isn't filled with uh, pre-alpha bugs. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace. Bye. Bye.